Chapter 38, The Mountain Pass. Che. Che, you awake? Che? Hey, Kef. Sorry I used you like a pillow. That's alright. Come on, let's wake up the others and get moving. Sure. Paul, get up! Eh, what? Get up! Wake up, Tobias, too. Aw, oh, fine, okay. Ouch! The hell, Halt? Get up! Get Vot, we're leaving. Let's go. There's no telling if Sunset Canyon's troops are on their way here. For all we know, King Mazal could be halfway to Argea. Sir, we're about halfway between Sunset Canyon and Argea. Good. I want us there in 24 hours. Sir, even if the winds were favorable, it would take three days. At least we can still beat the children there. Hey, Void Soldiers. I want you three to travel out ahead of us and intercept that boy, Vod. See if you can awaken a yard from within him. I'm sure the dragon will join us when he hears what the Void King's plans are. Yes, King Russell. And Kiss? You have my permission to terminate the boy with the glasses. I'm only interested in Vod. That's, That's not, not your order, King. Excuse me? According to the Void King, Kiff is supposed, supposed to live. I am the king of the entire known world. You are not in a position to argue with me. You, you may be king, but I take my orders from the god. god. You wouldn't want, want to get on his bad side, would you? Would you? Fine. Let Kef and Vought live. The rest of them you may do whatever you please with. Gladly. 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 Oh man, I haven't walked this much in a while. Kef, Che, Vought, can't one of you guys use super strength and carry me? You don't have super strength, just mind powers. Besides, Tobias, you need the exercise. Hey, I'm not fat, I'm husky. Played that one before. Come on, if we stop, we might get assaulted by soldiers. Yeah, but that might happen either way. Don't you know it's illegal for unaccompanied parties to wander in these mountains? Wait a minute, Kef? Saj, Johnson, what are you guys doing here? We just got transferred. Good to see you again. But seriously, we're gonna have to ask you to turn around. King Mazel hasn't got a firm grip on Northport yet. He doesn't want anyone entering or leaving until more Sunset Canyon soldiers can be relocated there. So we'll have to ask you kids to leave. Guys, we need to get through. We're in a hurry. You guys said we can't go by without accompaniment, right? Yeah. So why don't you two accompany us into Northport? Well, it might not fly with the higher ups, but I guess we could try. Not like it'll do any harm. Huh? What is it? Hey, Zosh, we need you guys to be on the lookout for a couple of wanted criminals headed your way. Alright, just make sure you watch out for a group of kids. Uh, kids? What do these kids look like? One's a girl with pinkish hair, one's a boy with a blue hat and glasses. There's another boy with sunglasses who smokes a lot. Another boy is a Sunset Canyonite, and the last one is kind of fat. Hey! He's not fat, he's husky! <laughs> So keep an eye out for those kids, okay? They've killed a few Void Soldiers, and our intel says they're headed to Northport. Roger that! I'll tell you if I see them. Duff? Yeah? You've got some explaining to do. I know. Ah, oh, Johnson, let him go. What? Zaj, you heard the commander. These kids killed a bunch of Void Soldiers. You and I know Cap. You would never kill anyone. We just can't argue with high command. They're right. I did kill the Void Soldier. But only because the Void King plans to destroy the world. Yes, go. What? That's good enough for you? All you kids just get out of here, and we'll have to report you to King Mazal. Zosh! Hurry up, go! I hope you know what you're doing. If anyone finds out about this, we'll be killed. Would you rather have killed a bunch of kids? I didn't think so.